The year is 585 BC. Greece introduces the drachma. Money is now considered tangible. The Athenian government is a thriving marketplace that is now defined as agora. Currency and trade is done using the new drachma. Mount Helicon is home to the nine muses of artistic creation, thought to be the, sort, thought to be the source of inspiration for all art and design. Well, it's now 2021. Blockchain and cryptocurrency has been introduced to the world. Values are defined by the users and through demand. In 2020, $55 billion was spent on in-game purchases. We consider that a liability instead of an asset for the gamer. I contributed to that. We are going to change that for you. Play to Earn is a novel concept. There's roughly a thousand blockchain games available today. Steam doesn't like them. I wonder why. There are over a million individual video games, but less than 0.1% of them offer any gamers the chance to transfer their assets. I think you would all agree, that's just not fair. So a quick show of hands, who here has spent a lot of money on games? Be honest. How much of that money did you actually get back? In homage to ancient Greece, Helicon NFT is working on a number of products. Starting with a gaming NFT marketplace that we call Agora, where gamers have ownership and control of their assets, and they can buy and sell them outside of the game. The Helicon Drachma Governance Token, or HDT for short, a hundred billion supply with a deflationary mechanism. Yield aggregators that offer passive earning opportunities. You can become a liquidity provider to mine our token through nine liquidity mining pools. And we empower the liquidity providers here at Helicon NFT through a master NFT function. And that's essentially a smart contract feature that allows the holder to earn mining and regular NFT rewards for 24 hours. Regular NFTs are what we call the in-game assets that can be bought and sold on the marketplace. And a gaming add-on system. So once a developer has created their NFTs through the Helicon game interface, we would work with those developers to blockchain and NFT enable those games and add normal functions to those NFTs and those assets within the game. And our own game, Helicon Titan. A multiplayer game where teams earn an in-game currency to upgrade those assets to a higher value to trade those on the marketplace. At Helicon NFT, we are bridging the gap between centralized games and decentralized NFTs. I'll go through those features again for you. An NFT marketplace, a governance token, yield aggregators for passive earning opportunities, and our own game IPs built specifically for play to earn. Now, I'll admit that's an extensive list of products. The exciting part is Helicon NFT is actually one product. We are the first all-encompassing ecosystem of its kind, combining all of these elements together to create an inter-gaming experience. That is unique, and that is a game changer. So why should developers join us? Well, through royalty mechanics, the creators of these NFTs can earn a percentage of every transaction after the initial sale. So who here would be a lot better off if you're still earning today from something that you sold years ago? I know I would be. I am a mechanic by hobby. If I was to design a lovely 68 Fastback Mustang digitally, wouldn't it be amazing if I could port that into a game like Forza using our Helicon game interface? And not only could I use that car in the game itself, but should I choose to sell that on to another player, I would get my percentage. If that player decides to sell it on, I would still get my percentage. That is why you, as creators and developers, should be excited by the Helicon add-on system. Helicon NFT is putting the power back into the gamer's hands. We're adding a new layer of revenue to what the developers already have, and we don't want to take anything away from that. The word philosophy comes from the Greek word philo, means to love, and Sophia, 
which is wisdom. And it's quite literally defined as the love of wisdom. And here at Helicon NFT, our philosophy over the coming years is to blur the lines between what we currently call blockchain games and traditional games, as digital assets become more seamlessly integrated into those users' experience. I'd like you all to join me later on today at 1.30 p.m. in the Helicon studio. Come and find out more about Helicon NFT. Feel free to ask any questions that you might have, and meet the, guy, the team from Bad Fox Studios, who are the first developers to join us at Helicon NFT. I'll leave you with a thought from the Greek philosophers. Character is destiny. There is nothing more permanent except change. Big results require big ambitions. Helicon NFT is willing to change the gaming industry. Are you willing to change with it? I'm going to take this opportunity right now as well to say a massive happy birthday to my mum, Beverly. She's here in the crowd with us today, so if you see her, show her some love. She's earned it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for your time today and for listening to me. Please enjoy the next few days here at Blockchain World DCS. Thank you.